Hello YouTube, it's me here again. Today we have a Sato FA100 converted to CDI ignition uh, with just the magnet ring and sensor bracket spark ignition as you can see there. Um, I'm pressurizing this uh, from the exhaust. This uh, material is um, silicone tubing, so it won't melt from the exhaust. If we use the normal gas, which is this one here, that will melt from the heat of the exhaust. Um, so I'm running a 20 to 1 mix on this setup. Uh, the prop, I think it's a Mars A screw 14 by 6. Um, top RPM, I think I'm seeing about uh, 85. Idles where I could hold it steadily at about 18 to 1600. If it's on the server, you'll be uh, much precise, but at the moment. That's why I could hold it steady with my hand with this little common push rod. I'm going to give it a start. I'm using my starter motor on it because of that prop. And it's so tiny. I don't quite like these tiny props. With my hands really. So. going to use my starter motor on it. Give it a start and see how it goes. Good. Get some current. Okay. Go. A bit more throttle. All right. That's it. There we go. You can see my hand is still a bit uh, shaky. Oh, the hold the top RPM really good um, with this prop. Uh, if you have the uh, low end setup on throttle or some servo, you will get the uh, right RPM. But uh, I could see on the reading, they get about a uh, 1600 on the low end. I'm sure you got low on that when you set it up in your plane. So you will check the uh, description of this video for links to parts for your FA100. And I think pretty much that's it really. Um, as the fuel, 20 to 1 mix. Um, timing on this, 30 degrees before top dead center. And 
pretty much that's it still pressurizing the tank so once again there will be some link in the description of this video where you'll find all the links to the parts to fit your FA100 okay stay tuned for more great videos to come cheers bye